Journal of Material Science was uh, founded by uh, Robert Kahn, uh, who's a colleague from uh, Cambridge who I knew personally. He had the, he envisioned really material science as its own discipline. With a name like the Journal of Material Science, we felt it really should be something, a journal that really really illustrated what material science is all about. And so what we're trying to do is really to serve the field of material science. Fundamental, basic material science, the application of materials, and really concentrating on not just the materials that are hot at the moment, but materials which we all rely on. And so that includes everything from natural materials to the most esoteric uh, synthetic materials. And the four new editors that we have added are Jamie Grunland from Texas A&M, Greg Rutledge from MIT, and Dallas Drinkle from University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. The fourth one is Pedro Camargo from Sao Paulo. So we are a very international journal and Pedro is the first editor from uh, South America. We also actually have a fifth editor and this shows the way that the journal has developed. The fifth editor who will be joining us is actually rejoining us. Uh, this is Wayne Kaplan of the Technion. Wayne has now just finished his term as Dean uh, at the Technion and so is coming back to be an editor on the journal again. At the moment we make decisions on all articles within a four-month period. Uh, we have been able to get uh, articles from submission to online publishing in about six weeks. And remember the Journal of Material Science, as I said, art archival articles. So we are not interested in a two-page report that may or may not be right. We're interested in articles which really thoroughly examine a particular topic. And so I think that's where we're really making our mark. Rapid publication, thorough reviewing, and uh, and very careful selection of the papers. So we, I'm afraid, only accept less than 20% of submissions. But uh, those 20% that we do sub accept are really of a very high quality. What we have uh, been able to do is increase the impact factor of the Journal of Material Science by about a factor of three in, in, during the last 10 years. That takes a lot of work. A lot of that is to the credit of our publisher, Springer, who have uh, made enormous efforts to get the journal out in a very timely fashion, but of course also to our editors who have decreased the turnaround. More and more uh, authors are particularly interested in seeing their work published in a very timely manner so that it's, for example, available for the next round of renewals for grants and so on. And so by having this rapid turnaround, we've been able to attract more, more uh, papers. By having uh, such a distinguished group of editors, that's also made it clear that our journal is really seriously, taken seriously by the scientific community. And we are now one of the top journals in what we refer to as multidisciplinary material science.